simplify the expression negative 5 over the square root of 40. This expression isn't in simplest form because we have a radical in the denominator. We want to get that out of there and also we can take um, some perfect squares out of this uh, radicand value of 40. Let's start by rewriting that 40 as a product of 4 and 10. So that we can take that square root of 4 out of the radical. So write negative 5 over the square root of 4 is 2. The 10 stays underneath. So we've taken as much out of the radical as possible. Now let's rationalize. We want to get this radical out of the denominator. So I'm going to do this by multiplying both the top and the bottom by the square root of 10. So negative 5 times the square root of 10 in the numerator and 2 times the square root of 10 times the square root of 10 in the denominator. This gives a negative 5 times the square root of 10 in the numerator. In the denominator, square root of 10 times the square root of 10, that's the square root of 100, which brings you right back to 10. So let's write the denominator as 2 times 10. Now I'm going to go ahead and cancel common factors. Don't cancel this 10 with the 10 underneath the radical. We can't do that, but we can cancel with these values that are outside the radical. 5 goes into itself once and into 10 twice. This leaves a negative square root of 10 in the numerator and a 2 times 2 or 4 in the denominator. After simplifying the expression, our simplest form is negative square root of 10 over 4.